Hello everybody and welcome to today's tutorial in which I, Jorner from Mobilio, am going to show you how to easily generate UPC barcodes with our software, the UPC Encoder. If you have watched our previous video about the EAN Encoder, you'll notice the great similarity in the interface. There are still two text boxes, one for the main content of the barcode and one for the add-on. You can also choose whether the human readable part to be displayed or not. If you want to know more about the UPC standard, why is it called like that, where is it used and how does it work, feel free to visit the blog of our website. Entering your digits and simply checking the result in the preview window is not all you can do with the UPC encoder. You can also change the height of the barcode, its printing scale, its background color, and even the color of the stripes. If eventually you end up with something you don't like, simply reset and try again. But be careful, because this will also reset the printing scale, and if unnoticed, it might cause you some troubles while exporting later. Once you are done with the creation process and feel satisfied with what you are seeing in the preview window, you can either copy the barcode to pasteboard, open your graphical editor, choose new from clipboard and do whatever customizations of the design you want, or simply export the barcode just the way it is in one of the three image file formats, PNG which is a raster image format, or EPS and SVG, which are vector images. I'm personally a fan of the vector images, and that's why I'm choosing EPS. There it is, the vector image, which has no loss in the quality when scaled. Well, that's all for now, guys. I hope that the video has been useful to you. If you still have some questions, or simply want to share your opinion about the UPC encoder, feel free to do so on our website, Facebook group, Twitter channel, or simply in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.